Hi guys, how are you? Today's our topic, bus bar tranking system. Don't confuse it with the normal bus bar. The normal bus bar would be inside only in panel. But this bus bar tranking system means the system which would distribute the electrical energy to the entire building. That I will explain with the help of a single line diagram. Here we have a single line diagram and it is the ground floor and it is the LV room and this MDB is located in the LV room and from this MDB our bus bar tranking is going through the riser to the top floors. We could make this bus bar tranking system maximum up to 12 floors and if you want to give the bus bar tranking system to the top floors then you need to take another bus bar tranking system from the MDB and extend it to the 13th floor that means from 13 to 12 floors that new bus bar tranking system would distribute the power and it is the first floor in the first floor this bus bar tranking system is going through the electrical room or the electrical rooms are typical same one above the another so in the electrical room there would be a tap of box to take the uh, bus bar tranking system to the SNDB and this tap of unit means it contains an MCCB okay here for example I gave a specification of MCB, MCCB as tripod MCCB with 35 kilo amp short circuit rating and its load rating is 200 ampere it's for just an example and the mounting height of this tap of unit is 50 to 160 centimeter from the FFL okay after this tap of you can give a cable from the tap of unit to the SNDB okay same like other floors also so now you might understood about what is the bus power tranking system now I just want to talk to you about the this tranking system in a detail it is actually a prefabricated system okay and it has an engloser engloser means the engloser which would enclose this tranking okay this tranking contains three phases and a neutral and also an earth bar and this engloser would be metal or non-metallic these bars would be of copper or aluminum material and we could connect this tranking system to different sources for example generator to transformer mdb motor okay and there are different shapes and sizes of this tranking system and also the different configuration all these depends upon the voltage and current of your system and some advantages about the bus bar tranking system the main advantage is we could replace the cables okay through that we could save the installation time and also the space we could save the space we knew that already if you use cables for your end electrical system you need to install cable tray and there would be a enormous space is required for the cable tray but here there is no need of that much space for the stringing system and the next advantage is there is less resistance and impedance when compared to the cables due to that there is less voltage drop and power loss and also the heat generation if you use cables then you would face all these problems very much and the next one is the flexibility of the system you can modify your bus bar tranking system at any time and also you could extend suppose you first installed your bus bar tranking system up to 10 floors 
later on if you want to extend this to two more floors then you could extend easily and you could replace your damaged bus bar tranking system this bus bar tranking system comes up not a single piece it comes up with piece by piece each piece contains three meter length so if there is any damage you would easily replace with the new one and the next advantage is the safety the fire hazards and the short circuit problem in the tranking system is very less when compared to the cables and next one about the disadvantages one disadvantage is it is exposed to the environmental factors like dust moisture corrosion and also damage and the next disadvantage it requires more protection and the insulation we know that this tranking system carries a heavy current so for to protect it from the unauthorized personnel we would require a high insulation and it could pose arc flash shock electrocution to the unauthorized persons so it's very important to protect it from the unauthorized persons and the another disadvantage high initial cost of the system this system requires engineering design and also the fabrication from the factory all these comprises a high cost of the system and the application in industries data centers and in buildings we would use this system i hope you got some deep information about the bus bar tranking system it's only a part one of this bus bar tranking system in the next part i will explain to you about the requirements of the bus bar tranking system so please tune for the next video and if you want more deep information like this Please subscribe my channel and visit my channel. Thanks for watching.